Hey guys, TrueBlack10 here, and welcome back to another video. Today, we're doing a top 5 villains who were actually right in Naruto, so, and Naruto Shippuden. So, for number 5, we have Obito and Madara, because, yeah, they're probably the worst villains to put on this, but still villains. They both acted on revenge, which isn't the best reason. That's why they're in the last position. But, yeah, that's why they're so low. And anyways, on to number four, which is, yeah, I think last time I tried to do this, I put, like, Orochimaru here. No, Orochimaru was, yeah, Orochimaru is here because... If you think about it, Orochimaru, um, like, kidnapped, like, gave Sasuke a curse mark, which made him come to him, and eventually Orochimaru puts Sasuke in a Genjutsu and tries to take, steal all these powers and stuff. That's why he did it, and he killed the third Hokage. May you rest in peace, Sarutobi. <laughs> Here is an whatever you're called anyway and uh, number three is usually people would put this at number two actually no number three is momoshiki now he saw kaguya's defeat and thought right my turn my turn to steal all the chakra and destroy the world base and revive the infinite Tsukiyomi thing is he lost to a 10 year old or an 11 year old however old boruto is how the frick does a grown adult who knows everything about jutsu who's in the otsutsuki clan who's a god for that matter get beaten by a 10 to 13 year old who does who knows absolutely nothing about it i want to know the answer but anyway Number two is Pain, or Yahiko, Nagato, and Conan. Speaking of Conan, I've got level 65 Conan in Naruto Blazing. Not giving it away, whether you like it or not. Anyway, so I'm putting these here because they were emotionally scarred. And what happened was they were in the second ninja... Second Great Ninja War, and their, all their small villagers got, like, attacked by the Leaf, and they were, and their parents were killed, and that's why Obito gave Nagato the Rinnegan, and then in, they met up, formed a trio, destroy, destroyed the Leaf in one second. That's why the number two, but number one has to be Black Zetsu and Kaguya. Now, what they did, Kaguya actually killed Obito. Rest in peace, Obito. And I'm surprised because that they actually killed off Obito because he was such a main villain, and then he turned good, and then they just killed him off. I want more Ubi Obito action. Come on, man. And anyway, then she tried to kill Sasuke and... Naruto af after reuniting all the chakra by using the infinite Tsukiyomi taking the bulb from the top and eating it because that's where all the chakra was and the people who were in the Tsukiyomi she would have transformed into white Zetsu like the entire world would have been transformed into white Zetsu commanded by her that's how bad of a villain she is jeez this video I would have thought it would be longer, but it's already it's only been four minutes and thirty seconds. Boom. And since there's thirty seconds till five minutes, I think I'll wrap it up here. Hope you have enjoyed. If you did be sure to hit that like button down below. Maybe we can get to six likes. That would be awesome. And if you're out new to this channel, please hit that subscribe button and click the bell to know when my future videos, top fives, streams and top tens are out. And I'll see you in the next one. Ten seconds till five minutes. And anyways, True Black 10. Come on, True Black 10, out.